And yes, the People's Democratic Party, PDP, they don't condemn the recent high price for fuel and electric money and from the federal government. The national chairman of the PDP, Uche Secondos, when he been addressed plenty provoked protesters, we've been visit the party campaign headquarters for Abuja in Yansi. The federal government and the All Progressive Congress, APC, so they don't bring heavy hardship on top Nigerians. And in Syria, so the federal government itself says that they continue to engage inside propaganda and uh, rhetoric without due regard to the hardship with the faced and the sentiments for the public space. They made all kinds of promises, including for the youth, unemployment, that they are going to create employment to all our youth. And power will be a thing of the past within six months. It is a colossal failure. Every responsible government must be very careful in making promises. They made these promises in 2015 when a bag of rice was 8,000 Naira. Today, a bag of rice is 35,000 Nara. Are we better off? No. Have they improved on the economy? No. The situation in Nigeria is pathetic. It has worsened. Our people are going through pains, hardship, and sorrow. Rather than providing solution and palliative, of course, you know, they have increased the pump price, they have also raised the electricity um, um, uh, tariff, putting more burden, more burden on the people of Nigeria. It is no longer party A or party B. The government must stop propaganda and face the reality and truth. 